I would like to address the commonly made assertion that immigrants are the primary contributors to the issues faced by Britain. For example, there is the belief that they have a significant impact on hospital occupancy, crime rates, and job availability. Based on the Pew Research Center's estimation in 2017, the illegal immigrant population in the UK accounted for less than 2% of the total population at that time. So, are we suggesting that less than 2% of the population is fully responsible for crowding hospitals? That assertion seems quite dubious when considering the health needs of the entire nation. Is it being claimed that all of them came to England already sick? This is a skeptical claim at best. According to the census on Census Day, 57.2% of people aged 16 and over in England and Wales were employed, and yet somehow less than 2% of immigrants are seizing all the job opportunities? The mathematics behind this argument raises serious doubts. Furthermore, the Ministry of Justice states that 27% of working-age adults in the UK have a criminal conviction, and 33% of men have been convicted. And still, is it being suggested that less than 2% of immigrants are responsible for the majority of crimes committed? There are clearly significant discrepancies in the calculation method, which some individuals seem to be conveniently ignoring. If you need further clarification or guidance, I encourage you to revisit the information and take some time to settle into your understanding. While you take the time to think, Remember that protesting without logical reasoning may result in unintentionally causing harm to the country you claim to love and cherish. Love all peacemakers, peace out. God be with you all.